morning children welcome back to your max class today we are going to learn a new concept in max that is ascending order and descending order do you know what is ascending order and descending order we will see let us meet rahul he has to climb 10 steps which are numbered from 1 to 10. Rahul starts from step number 1. He climbs on to step number 2. Then step number 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and finally to step number 10. Did you observe that as he climbs up each step, he is ascending or moving to a largest, biggest number than the previous number? Thus, we say that when the numbers are arranged from smallest to largest, that means smallest to biggest, they are called ascending order. So, you saw the video. Ascending order means num arranging numbers from smallest to biggest. Smallest to biggest. They are arranging numbers in ascending order. So, here is the range. Here is the range. That means 0 to 10, 10, 20, 20 to 30, 30 to 40 like that. This is also arranging in ascending order. First is 0. That is the smallest number. Then next. Then after that it is the 100 is the largest number. Okay. This is the range also. So, here first question is 17, 23, 9, 36. We want to arrange this in ascending order. So, ascending order means arranging numbers from smallest to biggest. Here, which is the smallest number? Yes, that is 9. That is 9. With this also, you have to see that 0 to 10, any number is there. In this question, 0 to 10, any number is there? Yes, it is 9. So, we will write 9 first. Then after that, cross it. Then, 10 to 20, any number is there? Yes, it is 17 is there. It is less than 20. So, we can write 17. Next step, then cross the soul. So, after writing the number, you have to cross it. Otherwise, it will make confusion. Okay, next year remaining numbers are 23 and 36. Among those which is the smallest number, so you can see that 10 to 20 we written number 70. Then 20 to 30 any number is there? Yes, it is 23. So we have to write 23 and cross it. Then which number is remaining? That is 36. Okay. First example. Next one is 45, 38, 63 and 50 is there. Among this, which is the smallest number? Yes, which is the smallest? You can see that. Say 38. So, that is the smallest number. That is coming under this range. 30 to 40. 38. In this range. Then 40 to 50, any number is there? 40 to 50. Yes, 45 is there. So, we have to write 45 and cross this. Okay. Then 63 and 50 is there. Among this, which is the smallest number? Here also you can see. 40 to 50 we written. Then 50 to 60, which number is there? 50 is there. So, we have to write 50 and cross it. Then which number is remaining? 63. That you have to write 63. So, the two examples. Then, one more example is there. That also we want to see. Which are the numbers? 18, 19, 12, 15. So, in, this is a special case. Because, in those numbers, 10's place are same. Which is the 10's place? 15. This is 1's place and this is 10's place. So, you can see that 10's place, place it is 1. 
So for all the numbers, tens place are same. So no need to look into the tens place. You have to see only the ones place and find out which is the smallest number. Okay, so which is the smallest number among this? It is 12. Very good. Then we have to cross it. Then which are the numbers remaining? 15, 19, 18. Among these three numbers, which is the smallest one? So which number comes after 12? 12 after 13, 14, 15, 16. So which number comes? 15. So this is the smallest number among 18, uh, 19 and uh, 15, 18 and 19. Which is the smallest number? That is 15. Then which number is coming next, next year? 18 and 19 is there. Yes, which number comes? Yes, that is 18. So you have to cross that 18 here. Then only one more number is remaining. That is 19. So this is ascending order. Numbers are arranging from smallest to biggest. That is ascending order. Okay. Okay. Do you know what is descending order? Descending order. We will see. Here is our Rahul again. He is on step number 10 and has to come down to step number 1. He comes down to step number 9 which brings him to a lower level than step number 10. Then 8 7 6, 5, 4, 3, 2 and finally to step number 1. Did you observe that as he comes down each step he is descending or moving to a smaller number than the previous number? Thus, we can say that when numbers are arranged from biggest to smallest, they are in descending order. We saw the video of descending order. So, descending order means arranging numbers from biggest to smallest. Descending order means arranging numbers from biggest to smallest. Like that ascending order, we arrange the numbers from 0 to 100 as ascending. Here, 100 to 0. This is, 100 is the largest, biggest number and 0 is the smallest number. So, we arranged like this. Okay. Here are three examples. So, for ascending, we wrote first number, that is smallest number. Here for descending, we will write the first number that is largest number. Okay. Among this, which is the largest number? 24, 18, 32, 55. Here we have to see that 100 to 90, any number is there? No. Then 90 to 80, any number is there? That also no. Then 80 to 70, any number is there? It is not there. Then 70 to 60, Starting from 70 to, uh, 70 to 60, no. Then 60 to 50. 60 to 50, yes. One number is there. What is that? In between 16 and 50, one number is there in between 60 and 50. Which is that? 55. So, 55 is the largest number among this. And so, those who are very much uh, interested to find out the largest number, without this range you can find out and write so those who need help you can draw or draw like this the range and you can find out the number okay so 55 then which is that smallest 55 after then 55 32 is there 18 is there 24 is there 24 18 32 among those which is the largest number yes which is the largest number Yes, that is 32. You can write using this range also. 
then 32, then 24 and 18 is there. Among this 24 and 18, which is the largest number? Which is the largest number? Yes, it is 24. Then, remaining, which number is remaining there? That is 18. So, we finish the first example. Then, second one, 74, 98, 22, 61. Among, uh, we want to see this range. 100 to 90, any number is there? 100 to number, yes, it is 98. So, first largest number is 98 among this numbers, okay? Then, 22, 74, 61, which is the largest number? Yes, that is 74. Then, among this two number, 22 and 61, which is the largest number? That is 61. Then, which number is remaining? 22. So, we will write this. Okay. Then, last question. 12, 11, 10, 17. In ascending order also, we saw that tens place are same. Here also, the tens place are same. 1, 1, 1, 1. Okay. So, which from this, we have to see the ones place only. We have to see the ones place and we have to write which is the largest number among this. Numbers 12, 11, 10, 17. Which is the largest number? Yes, that is 17. 17. Okay. Then, after that, 10, 12, 11, 10. Among those, which is the largest number? That is 12. That also we written. Then, 11 and 10 is there. Which is the largest number among 10 and 11? Yes, that is 11. That also we finish. Then 10 is remaining that we have to write as 10. So, today we discussed about ascending order and descending order. Ascending order means the numbers that are arranging from smallest to biggest. That is ascending order. And descending order, numbers are arranging from from biggest to smallest biggest to smallest that is descending order hope um, you all understood the topic so we will see you in the next class thank you all